Okay, hello, hello, hello everyone. This is part two of my garden journal. It is April 10th and my tomatoes are looking strong. I haven't had to tie them down yet. I do have little trellises I stuck in the ground so when they do act like they want to lean over I have some little clippies I bought from the 99 cent store and some ties from um, Lowe's and uh, I can clip them on there or tie them on there. Oh, they look pretty nice, vibrant and strong when, whenever, you know, they can't stand on their own. And uh, this, uh, hmm, this ain't really doing too much. It's a strong plant, but I'm not, uh, I'm not seeing any changes in it. This is my, uh, Rosemary. It's strong and beautiful. <clears throat> and these are my other herbs. I got some dead sage over here. This sage is not sage, this is uh, oregano. Oh, that came right out. Oh, it smells good. I think I'm gonna keep it. Maybe crush it up or something. <clears throat> my my time is flowering. I wonder if I should pull the flowers off. I don't know. Somebody help me out on that one. And this is the sage. <clears throat> my basil is coming back. Oops, let me put this down. I think that's basil right there. Yeah, got a couple of sprigs in there. Shoot, that could be time. No. Oh, let's see some here somewhere. Oh, looks like the time. Parsley is everywhere. And, uh, Oregano looks good. These onions are not doing a darn thing. I got them from the 99 cent store. I'm gardening, gardening through my <laughs> camera lens. <laughs> I'm not getting anything that way. <sighs> yeah. They are just basically sitting there. I have not been out here for damn, when was the last time? I think I came out here on Friday. Did not come out Saturday. Did not come out Sunday. Did not come out Monday. And I'm not going to water because it's supposed to rain for the next three days. So it's going to start tonight. I got a surprise for you. Hey! Okay. My, my rainbow in tomatoes have sprouted. They have worked their magic. Look at that one's coming up. This one, I don't see anything happening there. But everything's coming up. Yeah, and then 
I have, uh -uh. that's on there, right? So I've taken the lid off and put it on there askew so some air can get in there. Then I have planted some carrots and what else is in here? Carrots and and peppers. Carrots and peppers and more tomatoes. Brandy wine tomatoes. Rainbow carrots and rainbow peppers. This one I put out, I guess it was Friday. So they haven't, you know, they're still working their magic. Haven't done anything yet. But I'm so proud of my tomatoes. I'm going to have a whole wall. Ooh, that's, that sun is. Oh, yeah. Sun is a powerful thing, huh? I'm going to have a whole wall of tomatoes. <laughs> Yay! And then, that's, that's the little man right there. Hey, little man. You wet? Didn't you wet me? That little man. I transplanted my aloe vera, and aloe is looking happier. It's spreading his arms out. I'm in the light. And it's bringing some new leafage. And is the outer leaves are becoming green from the bottom. So, yeah. Aloe is happy. So, let's see. I'm going to um, look into... Oh, uh, little man over here won't let me get the, uh, the uh, raised garden beds. Because I got some watermelon... And some eggplant and some squash I'd like to plant. But I don't want them over there in that little strip. It'll take it over. So I saw these um, these garden boxes on... Um, who does that Mexico one plate at a time? Rick Bayless. Rick Bayless. Mexico one plate at a time. He did a show where he was cooking... Um, sauces and tomatoes from his garden and he was using these garden boxes that you cover with plastic and it keeps the moisture in and you put the water fill it up a reservoir of water and it waters from the bottom you only have to water once a week so I'm going to look that up tonight and try to get three of those so I can get some um, eggplant and some uh, watermelon and summer yellow squash going uh, yes it does it's hard but it does this and if I do it in this this um this box thing the garden box thing it will because it'll trap the the uh, moisture and heat in there so that's it for my second garden journal. Say bye bye, little man. Little man. You can get wet. Say bye bye. Hasta mañana. Keep it pushing. <laughs>